It is a bantamweight matchup between Ketlin Vieta and Misha Cupcake Tate. Well, she's got a UFC belt on the mantle because of her heart and her toughness. Realized that goal by stunning Holly Holm in the fifth round of their title fight at UFC 196. Misha Tate is really a fighter that is so respected by her fellow fighters, not just for the home fight, but in dealing with adversity against Sarah McMahon, in dealing with it against Ronda Rousey and Liz Carmouche, outstanding grappler, Misha Tate, long on toughness, long on heart, and finally back in the octagon tonight. Misha Tate is the former Strike Force Bantamweight champion and remains amongst the elite of the elite in the UFC's 135 pound women's division. All right, so here she is, the Andre Pederneris trained Ketlin Vieta, undefeated as she makes the walk here tonight. She's starting to believe she can be a UFC champion, Joe. The confidence is starting to catch up with the skills. She has worked very hard on her striking, which is catching up with the judo and jiu-jitsu. That is a scary proposition to the rest of this 135-pound division. This girl is so good at taking fighters to the ground from the clinch. She has a full arsenal of takedowns and throws from the clinch. Tying up with her is a dangerous proposition. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with similar height and some differences in reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Bantamweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a grappler, holding a professional record of 18 wins, 7 losses. She stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Misha Cupcake Tate! And now we're producing our opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 10 wins, no losses. She stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Minos, Arizona, Brazil, Catland, Venomino, Vienna! All right, great thing to lose in the locker room. I want you to be my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. Here we go. All right, so here is Manaus' Ketlin Vieta trying to get off to one of her patented hot starts here tonight. And you can just tell there is not only an increased comfortability and confidence inside that octagon, but she believes she's the best in the world. And now that she starts to carry herself that way, maybe she actually can realize a UFC title. Well, how good is that jab? Well, she has really found her timing in this round, Joe. All right, first round is underway now, and you've got to watch out for her powerful overhand punches. Most fighters in this division, they know what's coming, but as yet, they've been unable to stop it. Let's see how it goes here early on in this round. Nice. And a good jab. I'm trying to double up on that jab. Nice jab. Well, she got her head 
snap back with that jab, Joe, and she continues to show a vulnerability here by almost leaning right into her opponent's range. Let's see if she can move that upper body and get her head off the center line. She's doing a real nice job timing these shots, staying busy. Very good look for the judges here. They have started this fight off with a brawl. There's a takedown by Misha Tate. And now is where things could get really interesting. Posture's up. Posture's up now and lands a devastating strike to the head. Posture's up again and delivers another sequence of ground and pound there. Nice work there by Tate. That strike will count. Three minutes now, round one. Effective punch there by Tate. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. But look at that, Scoots. Back up. And potentially a critical takedown here. Attempting a choke now. She's out of the submission into full guard. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. The ground strikes starting to pile up. She's moved back to full guard now. Nice punch. Nasty elbows. Under two minutes now to go in round one. Oh, elbow to the head there by Tate. She's now in half guard again. Well, that's been a big weapon for her here tonight. Another big elbow by Tate. She moves to half guard. Well, it's hard to win a fight working off of your back, but that elbow is useful. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Nice punch to the body. Excellent movement here on the ground. A very nice elbow from the bottom. Oh, she's doing some serious damage with these elbows now, Joe. Back to half guard now. Nice elbow from Misha. She's now working from full guard. Wow, not sure if that one opened up a cut or not, but another big elbow by Tate. Gets the elbow up into the target. Into half guard again. Well, nice job staying active off of her back. Elbow from the bottom by Tate. She's working from half guard. Arm triangle attempt here. And she's out of the submission. Working from full guard. Nice shot to the head. Well, it's one thing to land a singular elbow. It's an entirely different thing to string them together. Beautifully done there by Tate. Well, the ground and pound has been on point tonight. Good work here by Vieta. She's in full guard. Staying busy from bottom position here. She's moved back to half guard. Second round, straight ahead. Oh, oh, oh. Let's take a look at it again here. And here's another punch that sneaks through. And here's another perfectly placed punch. Big round. Brittany Palmer in the building tonight. Joe, another stance switch here. 
Fieda gets caught with that punch. Well, without much resistance, she continues to find a home for that jab, just as she did in the previous round. Oh, now she's really starting to make her pay. The volume is starting to really tick up. That one hurt. Oh, she found the target there. That'll work. That's a nice clean shot. Well, she has landed some very significant strikes, but as yet, she has still been unable to string together anything in terms of a solid combination. And it is going to take strikes in bunches to get an opponent of this caliber out of there. Let's see where she goes from here. Elbow to the head there by Tate. Good control, posture's up. gets touched, and once again, it's that elbow. That has been there all night. Defense has got to be better. Goes upstairs for an elbow. Oh, postures up and delivers a massive elbow. Excellent posture here. Posture's up now, and she lands a huge elbow. Oh, beautiful elbow, beautiful elbows. Elbows landing now. Vieta gets caught by the elbow. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Posture's up now, huge elbow from the top. All right, under three minutes now to go in round two. Oh, a massive elbow from the top. Elbow now to the head, that one landed by Tate. Oh, again. Elbow landed there by Tate. Now she's in half guard. Oh, oh a beautiful, beautiful elbow. There. Back to full guard again. Posture and up now. Oh, lands a massive elbow. Just over two minutes now to go. She executes a very nice sweep and winds up in guard. She completes a single leg takedown. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground, staying busy. She moves into half guard. Keeping busy from bottom position here. She's now back to half guard. Doing some serious damage with those elbows, Joe. Moves to half guard. Oh, and now an elbow up top, I take. Into half guard here. Oh, another huge elbow by Tate. She's now transitioned to full guard. Pretty good elbow there from the bottom, Joe. She's staying active off of her back. Another hard elbow. Back to half guard. Oh, these are some massive elbows, Joe. That can't feel good. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. Oh, elbow up top by Tate. She's now in half guard again. Oh, another massive elbow by Tate. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Back to half guard now. Nice job staying busy here, working off of her back. Now she's in half guard. Moves to half guard. Oh, back to the well with that elbow. That one landed well. Into half guard again. Oh, she's got an arm triangle here. Moves to full guard. Final seconds here. She moves into full mount. All right, that's the end of round number two. No, 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 no.
Here's a nasty ground and pound elbow. And here is one more ground and pound elbow. And here's another beautiful ground and pound elbow. Thank you very much, Ariane Celeste. Continuing to work the body to great effect. Vieta gets tattooed by that stiff jab. Oh, she landed that punch, Joe. Good defense there. Oh, nice jab by Tate. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Oh, nice punch there by Tate. Roundhouse kick lands. Nice. She blocked the punch. Well, she got cracked to the head there, Joe. She continues to be vulnerable to that strike by leaning in, almost moving into the strike at this point in time. She's got to get her head off of that center line. Nice punch by Vieta. Oh, and down. Tate gets up and is back on her feet. Very nice. Oh, she blocks the punch. Oh, Joe, how good is that right hand? Doing an excellent job blocking here. Switching stances here. Nice punch there by Tate. Hand speed, man. Pretty good shot there. Excellent movement here on the ground. Oh, big elbow. Oh. She's now in full guard. Oh, postures up and delivers a big ground and pound strike to the head. Nicely done there by Tate. Beautifully executed sweep. Oh, nice strike there to the body. She has worked the midsection to great effect here in this round. Just missed with the left there. Jeff, I take another shot. Oh, take down there by Tate. Big Huge elbow, there, elbow to the head. Back to full guard. Very nice. Postures up. Oh, massive elbow lands. Oh, triangle. Over oh, two minutes to go. It. Tate gets caught with that punch. Now she gets her back. Very nice sweep. She's in half guard now. She moves to back control. Very nice sweep wound up in her guard. Oh, she is absolutely getting lit up right now. She has certainly changed her approach here in the latter stages of this fight. She is trying to take the judges out of it. That'll certainly help that goal. Works the double underhooks here. One underhook here. Oh, how about the slam there? That one cannot feel good. Transitions to full guard. Looking for a triangle, throws one leg over the shoulder. She popped out of the submission. Elbow by Misha. Oh, ground and pound elbow to the head. Nicely done to posture up and then land with full power. 
Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw off that stay. Busy here, you'd like to see that, Joe. Half guard. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Big body punch. Beautiful sweep. Nice sweep. Oh, she connected flush. Waiting seconds here of round number four. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. Let's see some of the action here. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Amazing highlights from that round. Ariani Celeste on hand. Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, so she continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like she did in the previous round. As efficient as any striker in the division, this is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground, staying busy. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. She's moved into side control. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. It's the elbow there. She's now established side control again. Oh, Vicious elbow. elbow lands to the head. Outstanding elbows. Side control once again. Excellent movement here on the ground. Working from the mounted crucifix. Big elbow. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. She's now working from side control. Half guard. Vieta gets touched by the elbow there, Joe. In half guard now. She moves to full guard. Pins down that wrist. She got her arm out. Trying to spin to the back. Tate gets up and is back on her feet. Very nice. She blocks that offense, Joe. Good punch. Well, she hit that hook shot like a champion, Joe, but she's got to be careful. Moving into her opponent's range, largely unguarded. She has been susceptible here early. We'll see if she can adjust. Oh, nice jab up top by Vieta. Under two minutes now to go in the round. Let's go, fight. Good kick. Tate's pummeling works in that underhook. 
Double underhooks now in the clinch. We'll see what oh, she can do. Man. Tate gets back up again. Nicely done. Connects with the punch there. Oh, good defense here to stay upright after that single leg takedown offering. Battling for hooks. Right hand forward now, switching to southpaw. Does not get to the target. Nice job defensively there. Oh, this could be it right here. She might try to finish this fight here. Vicious combo there. Tate's hook shot there looked pretty good, but blocked by the defense. Back to orthodox. Well, her approach defensively, Joe, is leaving a lot to be desired here. She's almost moving into her opponent's striking range and eating that jab. It's not necessarily a power punch, but she can't take too many more of those. Well, she whiffs on the straight right hand. Oh, nice jab. Successfully avoids the clinch. She's doubling up on the jab there. So she goes back to the stool now. We'll see the extent to which she can recover. As many of you know, 60 seconds, not a lot of time. And here she lands one devastating punch to the head that stuns her opponent. And here's another punch that stuns her opponent. And here she lands one more devastating shot that stuns her opponent. And as you can see by these clips, some devastating damage in that round. Ariane Celeste on hand as usual. You ready? You ready? Go, Fifth go. and final round, fourth cover. She blocked the punch. Tate gets caught with that punch. Hard hook. Vieta gets tagged again. Oh! This could be it. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Oh! Big shot! Tate's got double underhooks now. Underhook here. Tate gets the double underhook. Oh, high oh, punch to slam, Joe. Tate gets up and decides to take this fight back to the feet despite having a dominant position on the ground. Back up. Trying to get a single. Triangle, arm triangle. Nope, lost it. In the full guard here. Both fighters get up now. She switched to southpaw here. She did a real nice job there avoiding the clinch. Doesn't want to be there. Oh, huge block oh. for her, Joe. No. This could be it right here. Slam, Joe. Beautiful knockout strike here for the victory. Yeah, that was just a beautiful shot by her there to end the fight. I'm not sure she could have drawn it up any better than it played out here tonight. She lands the seminal blow there midway through the round. I'm not even sure her opponent saw it coming. So big, big knockout win for her here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Watch this again here.
Well, there she is. Man, did she have it going here tonight as she gets the huge win by knockout. Near perfect execution, and that could be one of the better knockouts of the year. The decision Ladies is inside the octagon. It resides yeah, with Bruce Buffer. Stop this contest at one minute, 51 seconds of round number five. To play the winner by knockout, Misha Well, she's got all the tools, Joe, and she certainly put them to good use tonight as she gets the win and gets so with style points by way of the knockout. No judges needed for this one, and you can be sure her bankroll is going to be fatter on Monday morning. She'll probably get a bonus. At the very least, though, the celebration is on. You see there with her coaches and her teammates, nothing better in all of pro sports than to win a mixed martial arts fight at the highest level. Congratulations. Only difference is my cloud is too massive. We active when actors get